A close-knit group of about 40 students make up TPS's first early college program on Tulsa Community College's Northeast campus. A big head start, like a, a jump halfway, almost there. Ninth grade student Keyshawn Williams is already taking some college credit courses. I don't want to be embraced, so I better go to college. As Tulsa Public Schools wrestles with plans to restructure schools, two of its three proposals call for its early college program to expand. So what we've tried to do is provide an environment uh, in high school uh, for students to be successful in their high school classes and yet at the same time have the opportunity to connect with uh, a college campus and some of the activities on the campus. Now, what do you have to do with it? Dr. Marsha Edmonds, principal at Early College High School, says every student earns some sort of college credit. Some students graduate with not one but two diplomas, picking up an associate's degree in addition to completing high school. It feels like a family here to our students, and they are very supportive of one another. And they have bonded like I've not seen students bond in a long time. Do the same thing you did up here to find what you would add. Under the plans, Rogers High School would become the new site for the early college, which would house grades 7 through 12. It's a wonderful program. It's, it's going to really raise the expectations. It fits with what we're doing in the district and trying to raise the college readiness of all of our students. Two elementary schools nearby would feed into the program, and the rest of the seats would be decided by a lottery system. In the end, students would be required to graduate with an associate's degree. The hope would be that they've already seen themselves as being successful. Why would you not want to just go two more years and go ahead and get your bachelor's degree? Good job. Okay. Okay. Next step. We're all